Hi everyone, myself Tanish, and in this video, what I'll be doing is I'll be clearing out the basic, you know, definitions or some key concepts that are, you know, widely used in app development, such as native, hybrid application, what are languages, you know, Flutter, Java, Kotlin, what are languages you need for hybrid application, what are languages you need for native, what really are these terms that I'm using, we'll be talking all about that, so let's begin. Just so we are on the same page, let's just clear out what an app developer really does. So as the name suggests, app developer is someone who creates app for mobiles, you know, using the software and all his coding skills or whatever. So yeah, creation of apps and all comes under app development. There are two types of applications in which you can build your apps. That is native and hybrid application, right? So what are them? So native application is something in which uh, when you build your application, when you build your app, those will run only on a single platform like let's say just on android or whatever application you have made they would run just on ios right so next way is hybrid application in this whatever app you make whatever you know application you have made they would run on multiple operating system like let's say they would run on windows then they would run on ios then they would run on android on multiple operating system whatever app you have made they are able to run While creating native applications that app, apps that you would use is let's say if you're creating an Android app, right? So for those you'll use Java and Kotlin and if you're creating an iOS application for them you'll be using Objective-C and Swift. I don't know why for some reason I just keep forgetting the languages. So the languages that you would need for hybrid applications would be React Native and AngularJS. Now if you're a beginning and you're just like going to begin this then it is recommended that you always start from native applications and this also you have two options that is java and kotlin now kotlin is fairly a new language so it is always recommended to learn java as whatever you know queries and questions you'll be having you'll just you'll be able to get them quickly on google so quick recap um, app development is something in which you create an apps now for this you there are two ways two applications native and hybrid in native what you do is you create an app that will run only on a single platform maybe ios only or android only for these the languages that you need would be for android it would be java kotlin then for hybrid application this is something in which you create an app that would run on multiple operating system that is windows um, android and ios for these the languages would be react native and angular js as a beginner you should choose java native 